Okay. Uh, I'm Roger. Daniel. Um, I'm, uh, I live in London, in North London. Um, I'm visiting Barmer because I, I play an ancient Chinese game. And, um, oh, you're a Go player. You've been at the Go uh, oh, competition. We've, we've just had um, Peter. Peter here. We've been playing the violin together. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, do you I, know are you related to Peter? Peter, um, I've forgotten his name. Uh. I think I know who you mean. Oh, you're not, because he's with his parents, you see, and I wasn't sure. Anyway, you, were, you came in here and you began to talk in a very interesting way about the population and the danger of the population growing more, and almost the inevitability of growing. Could you well, say that again? Um, I was born 60 years ago, and the population was about 2,000 million then, approximately. And... Uh, in my lifetime, the population has increased by 5,000 million, over 2,000 million. That's an increase of two and a half times. If human beings, culture, society, civilization doesn't change, that means it continues the way it's continued over the last 60 years, there's going to be a further increase of two and a half times the population if it doesn't change. That means 7,000 million increased by two and a half, thousand, uh, two and a half times gives about 26,000 million people by all the end of another 60 years. All crammed into a country that's got a less of a, less of a shoreline. Earth, on so the planet Earth, on the planet Earth. grandchildren. So, um, the only way that will change is because human beings change. If human beings don't change, then they're going to carry on that, their behaviour, maybe uh, dynamically start and stop a little, a little time, then a lot, then a lot on average, then uh, there's going to be an increase from 7,000 million to 26,000 million. The only way that can change is because human beings change. And how well, can that happen? I don't know how that, that can happen, but it's asserted that it will be only 9,000 million. But you see, 9,000 million is a lot different from 26,000 million. Yes, so obviously, somehow or another, there's going to be either going to be an internal change in human beings naturally occurring, or something is going to make and that's all I know.